This is a book that is about the civil rights movement. It is not a book dictated by a love story. Even though obviously if there's a love story is there. It's not dictated by that. It's dictated by what went on during that period of time, which was a transitional period. And the people of my generation, you will note, Cole Bishop is based on me. I was that quarterback for the football team. You know, yeah, I know, God. <laughs> Got to remember it was a long time ago for crying out loud. I wanted to bring Marie Fitzpatrick in in a dramatic way. Well, the most dramatic way I could think of was for her to confront the entire football team. Not one person, but the whole team. And to say, Ray, who are you guys? You don't intimidate me. I'm not bothered by you at all. So she uses two things. She uses that incident to establish an instant uh, reputation. And she uses her brain to terrify everybody. The character of Marie, the one it came from, came from a woman from Tennessee mm -hmm. that, that when I was going to college, I worked in New York City on 43rd Street in Times Square as a waiter in a place called Toffinetti's. And there was a woman that worked in that place uh, who was from Tennessee. She was a mate, she was a hostess. She was exactly like Marie. She was tough as nails and would say anything, and it didn't bother her at all if, if, uh, if it upset you. And, that, and, and this is what I'm talking about when the characters tell you this. I had no idea that Marie were going to teach these little children when I started that book. I had no idea. But all of a sudden, one day she said, I'm teaching these kids. I thought, Ah, oh, good. I wrote, typed over 8,000 pages to get to this in six different versions. Actually, the first version I wrote is a better book, and it's a lot more controversial, a lot more controversial. I like that lingering thing, so that means that when you close the book, you walk away and you think about it. I don't care how you think about it, but you think about it, and that matters. It also matters that no matter what you say, you will realize the importance of the relationship between Marie and Cole. That Marie brought in the message, Cole got it. And the reason I didn't make it a love story is because I wanted, I wanted the emphasis to be on what was, what was the impact on young white people my age during that period of time. How many books on the civil rights movement have you read written by sub white Southerners my age <laughs> who actually lived in a segregated world, went through the civil rights period and, you know, and now lives in a desegregated world? This is the most important thing I have ever written. It is the most important thing I will ever write.